Hey everybody, it's Ryan. This is Jamie, my girlfriend. Today we are sitting in the John Deere 4640 and we are harvesting corn. Now, a couple videos back, we taught Jamie how to drive a John Deere X730 lawnmower, lawn tractor. So today I figured that we'd step it up and teach her how to drive a bigger tractor, an actual row crop tractor. And today's her birthday, so be sure to make, uh, wish her a happy birthday in the comments. <laughs> All right, are you ready to learn? Yep. Okay. Here we go. So are you ready? Yep. Okay, now the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is to start the tractor, and it's just like a car. So I'll look for the key. Okay. Let's go ahead and start it all the way. Just hold it until it starts. Good, okay. Now the second thing you wanna do is to adjust the steering wheel to where it's a, in a nice spot for you. So keep one hand on the wheel and then reach down with your right hand. See that lever down there? Pull up on that, you know, drop it down. Is that comfortable? Yeah. Okay. So, have you ever driven anything with a clutch before? Um, when I was 16. Okay, so she has some kind of experience driving uh, vehicles with a clutch. So, now what you're going to want to do, it's in park right now. This tractor has a power assisted park release, and basically it's fancy 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 wording for you have to put it into like drive before you can move so push in the clutch which is down here push it all the way in there you go now the next thing you want to do is to put the far right lever into a so push it it's in park release so you're gonna have to give it some force need some help there I can't do it. When you're on flat terrain, it isn't going to be like that. And then, since we're facing downhill, you're going to have to put the actual shifting levers into 1R, which is all the way down. There you go. Okay, so do not release the clutch. Quickly, that is. Excuse us for all the junk in here. It's been a long day, so. All right. Slowly release the clutch now. Very slowly. Okay, push it back in. Now put your right foot on those brakes. The tractor's moving. Put, push down. On both of them? Yep, put both of them. Okay, you ready? <laughs> You're gonna have to push, push, shift this lever into one. This one? Yep. Because here's your shifting pattern right there. So you're gonna wanna put it into A1. So shift it up one spot. Push it forward. There you go. Now it's in place. Now when you release the clutch, the tractor will slowly start moving forward. And you can release the brakes at the same time, very slowly. Oh, at the same time? Yep, same time. There you go. Now, <laughs> to control your actual speed while within the gear, you're gonna to wanna to control your engine speed, which is the small yellow knob by the shifting levers. So if you push that forward, you're gonna start moving faster. This one? Yep. It's orange. What did I say? Yellow. I called it yellow. The orange lever. So go ahead and push it forward. Push it forward. There you go. If you watch, your engine speed will increase as you Keep going. Make sure all the way up there. All the way. All the way. All right. Turn left. Right now. Yep. Turn left. Now, since this is a partial power shift, you can switch to A2 automatically. So move this handle to the left. That's one. Yep. Move it to the left. Now we just sped up. <laughs> Go straight through the middle of them. So try to drive the middle of the tractor straight down the middle of the gate. Take it right. There you go. Oh my god, what if I hit them? You're not gonna hit them. I'm here. Am I straight enough? Yep. Are you sure? It's 
follow the tracks. We're hauling a load of grain back from the combine now. We're taking it to Travis. Just freaking out a little bit. <laughs> I shifted it up to B range for her, so we're going a little bit faster, but it's nothing, nothing she can't handle. We start to feel uncertain, just pull back that smaller now. That's the end of speed. The yellow one? Yeah, the yellow one. <laughs> the orange, small one. Here she goes, driving her first tractor by herself. They learn so quick. Jamie, take the wheel. Take it from my head. Alright guys, I only taught Jamie the very bare basics because uh, since she's still a beginner, I won't really have to teach her how to use the SCVs or the power takeoff or anything fancy that much. So um, this is all we're doing today. Now she can actually drive the tractor on her own and actually steer the steering wheel. I'm a pro. She's a pro. <laughs> so thanks for watching guys. Be sure to check out all our videos and we will see you next time.